what your body gotta do. What? Hey, what's up guys, it's Sinu with Pokemon Video and today I'm going to be teaching you how to shrink video size using your Android device without losing any quality. So I just rendered this intro right over here from After Effects and it looks really cool and stuff but the thing is the size is not cool. So as you can see if I go ahead and just search on the properties of this uh, like um, video. So as you can see right over here, it have 1.7 gigs, just 1.7 gigs. That's just a lot for a video guys. So today we are looking on how to just shrink that so let's get started then now you need to go to the link in the description below and it's going to take you to google play store basically download this app which is called android vid pro so it's free app as i told you before the link is in the description below so once you get downloaded this app go ahead and just basically open it up and hit on the video button and choose the video that you guys would like to shrink its size so in my case this one and as you can see you can see that uh, like taskbar right there on the top so scroll up from the left as you can see we found this button which is called convert so press on that convert button right over there and from here we need to copy my settings so for the video resolution you need to set the exact same resolution as your video resolution so this video resolution is 1080p so i'm gonna head and just basically put 1080p just like that and once you hit on it you just go ahead to the format and also make sure that the format is always set to mp4 however if you find this like by default mp4 i'm sorry but your video is unshrinkable you can't actually make your the size of your very own video lower because is already shrinked and keep in mind if you have an mp4 video it may work it depends of the size so if you have like a real large size it's going to shrink it well if you have another format than mp4 it's surely gonna work so keep, keep in mind in that and also for the last step or the last choice as you can see this is the quality it should be like medium uh, by default you can go ahead and say to like low but the goal of this video is to get a high quality with a lower size so go ahead and just choose a high quality of the video and hit on that button on the top right corner and it will start rendering so the rendering process shouldn't take a really long time well it all depends on how long is your video now my video is about like eight seconds so as you can see it took me about like three seconds or maybe more than that and as you can see here is the result now let's go ahead and head over to the es file explorer and go ahead and test it out so this is the original video that i rendered from Adobe After Effects and let's go ahead to the properties and let's see the size as you can see we must find like an insane size with the like 1.7 gigs which is super a lot for a video and now let's go ahead and head over to the properties of our video that we just edited and let's go ahead and go to the properties and see so you can see what over here we have 5 megabytes only like guys from 1.7 gigs to 5 megabytes is a lot so as you can see it's really really work and really awesome like way to get more space certainly if you are like an editor you like work a lot with Adobe After Effects and Cinema 4D just like me it's going to be like a really really helpful option for you so you can go ahead and just shrink your videos and make them like less bigger and also guys if you want to upload them on youtube it's not going to really take a really long time it's really really fast process and also guys for the viewers it of course is going to load a lot much faster and yep i guess that's about it and before we just end this video let's go ahead and test out the image quality so let's go ahead and head over to the image quality uh, the video sorry and let's see and as you can see it's clean everything is like just like before the only thing that we lose is the size which is a really good thing for us but the quality it stays the same which is really really awesome and like I, I don't understand how this this app like do it but anyways it's actually shrinked the size without touching the quality which is really good option for us so i think that's about it for this video guys if you guys enjoyed this video please be sure to give it a big thumbs up down below because that would mean a lot for me and also guys check my channel out because there is a lot of amazing and daily videos in there subscribe to my channel if you enjoy me already and i'll see you guys tomorrow with another video peace out